The disability rights movement formed in the years following World War II, when an ever-growing group of young people with different disabilities recognized that they weren't being treated the same as everyone else. They desperately wanted to go to school, get jobs, and raise families. They had a difficult time doing any of these things, partly because many able-bodied people thought that they couldn't and didn't even want to live full lives. And so this group of young activists decided to do something about it. Disabled people feel that there is nothing else that we can do at this point but come to the streets and show the American public why we need their support and how we have a right to be able to work and raise families and get on and off the bus and on and off trains like everybody else. And that's what this is all about. We are members of society and we will talk their story, often overlooked, spans decades. But this video will introduce you to it. It describes a long, hard fight that is still not over. What began after World War II as individuals struggling to survive turned into a collective fight for equal rights by tens of thousands of people with disabilities. Their determination forced the signing of the Americans with Disabilities Act one of the most far-reaching pieces of civil rights legislation in history.